Thank you for tuning into the home of Nanny Dolls 314. Hey, we're going to get started in a minute. Let me play my little intro. Yeah, you already know. I got my own intro. Hit that thumb. Hit that thumb up. All right. Been on two. Uh, I've been on YouTube about three years, and I always hearing people talk about the blue dog, the blue dog, and I'm just trying to figure out like. When it comes to the blue dog, why it still sells? Why do blue dogs still sell? Like, I mean, like people say is that, you know, it's about the, you know, the dog. And my thing of it is, hold on, there we go. My thing of it is, this is a blue pit bull right right there that's in the box. Now, hit the thumb up. It's a blue pit bull in there. Now, it, that that blue dog has to bruise has to hit, has the muscle structure. So, it's like people say that everything is a bully or a band dog. But it should never be that a color of a dog, a color of a dog should make you not know a dog. I mean, like people, like when it, when it comes to like blue dogs, okay, my thing of it is people say, oh, it's an animal stuff. That's a this, that's a that. But okay, if, if your dogs supposed to be American pit bull terriers and they doesn't look like American pit bull terriers. Hey, hit that thumb up if you have it. They don't look like American pit bull terriers. Like they look like am stats or bullies. It's like you tell people that these dogs supposed to have Bruce Lee body. These dogs supposed to have Bruce Lee body at the end of the day. You should be able to know it. Put it like this. If you out somewhere, you shouldn't have to look at nobody documents and pedigree to know if they got American pit bull terriers. You shouldn't. It's no way that a person should have to look at it. Oh, let me see your pet, your uh, pigs. No, you should be able to say that's a pit bull off for the looks. See, when you think about American pit bull terriers, you think of you know animal aggression, muscle, Bruce Lee body, um, you know, easy to please. Um, you know, you 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 see more than what people make it seem about American pit bull terrier because it's not a dog that just has a one goal to it. You know, you you more hear people try to glorify one goal. I do not breed, train, no dog for a legal purpose. I don't believe in the legal purpose of doing anything with a dog. I like dogs to be dogs where they can be family dogs and all that. But you know when you when you think about when you think about uh, American people a terrier, you think about more than people saying American people a terrier for the animal aggression. Okay, well, you named your dog Killer before it can ever do anything in life, and you're gonna say that, and then you say we buy dogs from people that's not reputable breeders. But my thing of it is, when it comes down to it, is that a dog that cannot reproduce and have puppies is not good stock. He cannot reproduce. So when you buy it from reputable breeders, top breeders, your male should never be a stud. 
I mean, be a dub. Never be a dub. You know, when you think, when you salute, hit that thumb up. When you think about <coughs> about the dogs, you you always think about what makes a per a person a reputable breeder. See what people call reputable breeder. Okay, if he was, if your person that you bought your dog from reputable breeder, that your male cannot reproduce, that you're supposed to get another dog. You're supposed to get another dog because you have a dull male that the heat the person that you bought it from knew you was going to try to breed it. So, and then you call yourself a reputable breeder, and then you tell everybody that blue dogs, because I know you're going to watch this, blue dogs are not pit bulls. Okay. So let's go back to the research about the dog. They said that you had to put Terrier and Bulldog together. Okay, you can put American Staff or Terrier, that's Terrier, and you can put Bulldog, makes it pit bull. At the end of the day, people killed me saying that Blue Dogs was, that Blue Dog been exist, created, known about since 1946. 1946. This dog been this, this dog been on the map before people can say they was bullied or they was this. They was created by a reparable American pit bull terrier breeder. They was not the best of the best, but they did exist. So how? You can say that, and then, then you take the credit from picture Kobe dog that got registered first. You take the credit away from him and call him a bulldog. No, he was registered. You say papers and pedigree. His papers and pedigree says he's American pit bull terrier before you ever had American pit bull terrier. Before you can even tell us what American Pit Bull Terrier is from, you cannot go back and people get this. Y'all cannot go back. Y'all cannot go back and try to take back from the people that put these dogs on the map and say they dogs is this, that, 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 because you don't like what these dogs is, because your dog don't fit the requirement of, of, of back in the day. At the end of the day, you can always have with American Pit Bull Terrier a throwback. It is such thing as a throwback. A throwback is a dog that comes back from generations after ge a generation before it was even created. So when you think about this dog, this blue dog, it's been around since 1946. And you and that listen, you've been on YouTube since 2006, 2007, 2008, whatever year you've been on here. You've been on the internet trying to tell everybody what dogs is, and you're not selling dogs. So when you worry about these blue dogs, these listen, these blue dogs sales. I had six, listen, I had six puppies. I had two blue fawns and four blues. I sold the four. No, hold on. Was it four blues? Hold on. Yes, I sold the four blues with no problem. No, nobody when nobody's criticizing, nobody came back. The dog will be in five more days. The dog will be um hold on. Five days in five days that put them puppies would be a girl. I have had no complaints in 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 the eleven months and couple more days for the what basically say twelve months. I have had no complaint, but at the same time, 
you see people sits on the on the computer and they try to criticize somebody that know how to sell dogs that knows about the American pit bull terrier more. I don't have to listen. I do not have to glorify the ugly sport of American pit bull terrier because I don't. That's not the only highlight. And then people say that the the blue dog and the bullies are killing the American pit bull terrier. Nope. Every time they go in these backyards and these houses and they take in these dogs out from for illegal purposes, that's what's killing the breed. That's what's killing the breed. Don't never say that another, how can dogs who's not coming out of a yard, not coming out of a house, is killing the breed. If anything, you would say, like other dog men say, that is helping the breed because at the end of the day, you can use that all dogs do not get took it out of it. But hey, you know, people want to be a very intelligent and think they're very comprehend and they don't even understand the, the dog. They don't understand the dog <laughs> because you don't listen for a much. For, let me explain something to you. American pit bull, a real American pit bull terrier. You are, we gonna use the words you use. Real American pit bull terrier could not be locked in the crate that long. That mother would been an eight out the crate. It, it, it's no way because um uh, you got bad stock. Did y'all wait till I got red boy Jocko Bolio all that? Show me them pay. You want to see my paperwork? Show me your pay. They said because I know each last one of them dogs you saying is a high energy dog, and the dog that you're showing as American pit bull terriers have low energy. They don't. They are not energized dog. They're not energized dog. You see your pit bull? She's chunky, fat, laying on the ground, laying on the ground. But you want to talk about everybody a dog and how much the dog weight? The hawk is a big dog that can work. That man-made pet, whatever you want to call it, a big dog. Blue, big dog. Work. Work. When we say work, they mean these dogs. You see these dogs moving around, being, being a dog with high energy. How could you say that you have a good stock of American Pit Bull Terrier when we don't see the dog move and do nothing? How could you tell anybody that your dogs are working dogs when we don't see it on no, on no throat pole? We don't see it on no trail mill. We don't see you walking it. We don't see it running. We don't see it do nothing but use her uterus and got stuck with her. She got listen. Her first litter is she holds her whole litter still on the yard. Her whole litter is on the yard because you call yourself a reputable breeder that took an American pit bull and bred with an American bull dog. But your replica, you you stand up for an American pit bull terrier. If you stood up, if, if people always want to talk about my dogs and what blue dogs and agree with him, but if you were so honored to the American pit bull terrier, you would not take no other breed and breed it with American pit bull terrier, but American pit bull terrier. But American pit bull terrier. That's the only thing you should take to be able to breed with American pit bull terrier. At the end of the day, let me explain something to you. If you if you stand up that you are about this breed. Now, my thing is, if it works for you, breed your dog how you want to breed. It's your dog. It's your dog. If nobody wants to buy it, oh well, then you'll be like the dummy that's stuck with 14 puppies. And talk about everybody sitting on the internet every day showing some talking about my dog eat the best, but your dogs are not being sold because you're too busy worrying about my dog, Hulk, this man, that man, this man, and you're not selling a dog. How are you a reputable breeder? How do you have a waiting list and you stuck on 14 puppies? Tell me that. Tell me how are you this reputable breeder that's the best in the game? Learn from all the old schools, and you stuck with 14 puppies out of 15. One died. If the one didn't die, you'd have 15 puppies. You stuck with, but you're a rapper of breeding. You have a wait list. What is wrong with your rating list? What is wrong with the wait list? Because these puppies, okay, let's put it like this Max finna be one, them bulldogs finna be two, the other dogs is finna be what about 10? 10, 11 months, and you ain't sold no puppy. 
Max don't live with his sibling. They live in other people's houses that bought them. But you want to talk about Max and his daddy and his mama and what they got and what I lied about. But you lied and told everybody his mama was fit, clown. You the same person that told everybody that hit that thumb up if you haven't that his mother would fix and you didn't want to breed your dog with it. But to this day in 2023, you still mad about the situation. So who is the person? Oh, I don't talk about people that don't talk about me. I don't worry about them. They hating on me. But every time I turn around, it. This about this dog and this about my dog and my name come up and this come up about me. But you so busy worried about me and you ain't got no moolah, no moolah out of your puppies. You are spending money and not making money. But you worry about, but you, you worry about, salute, you worry about polar nanny dog dogs. And then they, I can say, listen, I didn't even bring my dog again. But guess what the killer part about? Wait and see, because I put that on everything. Remember, every time you play games with me, I go get a new dog. You know, I got a new bitch about to come along. A whole, a whole new bitch. Promise you that. A new one. In the womb right now. Process it. Coming out. Do you understand what I'm saying? See, that's what you don't understand, dummy. Because at the end of the day, I know how to breed a dog. I know what to look for in a dog. Just because you say you the you the you know everything about a dog, you don't know everything because at the end of the day, you think that every dog that used the word the American pit bull terrier is is wrong, and then you think everything you could call a bulldog. Hold on, let me grab me a drink. Hold on. Come on, what the hell? Oh, there it go. But yeah, thinking every er, everything that you you can call it and call everything a bulldog, then tell everybody, oh, they mislabeling. At the end of the day, you you call yourself knowing about this dog, but you ain't did no research on the American pit bull terrier to know that this dog came along in 1946. 19. 46, not 1990, not in the early 2000, you dumb and literary mother cucker. This dog came along 1946, 46, not 99, not zero, zero, dummy, 1946. But you talk about dogs that you don't know nothing about. Nothing you know nothing about. Nothing you know about. This American, um, I know about dogs. I'm a ripper of breeder. They cannot sell one puppy. Cannot sell one puppy. Not one of them. <clears throat> but yeah, you know, it's it, it, it's 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 kind of funny because it's like everybody can talk. But nobody wanted to do the research. When it comes down to the research of dogs, it's easy for people to use a platform and, and talk about dogs that doesn't mean nothing to the, the port of life. The port of life. They don't know nothing. You got to think about it. If you knew all this about the dogs and you knew about it, and you've been dealing with American people with terriers, and, and you've been in the dog game since the 50s, the 60s, and the 70s. You should be known better than YouTube. You known as YouTube. I'm known. 
because you can't find nobody that knows you but a YouTube dude. So what reputable British yours you been on? You say you got King Court, so South Africa boy boys, uh, uh, German Shepherds, Rock Rollers, uh, Boxers, uh, Pug, and we cannot see none of these dogs, but you speak on everybody a dog. You speak on everybody a dog, but you won't speak on, you won't speak Hello. Salute, Nanny. What's up, man? What's up? Now, nah, I just wanted to show you this this uh blue red nose I got that I'm about to take to my uncle. Three months old. Wait, the dog got a red nose? I'm finna let you see what it is. Wait, it's blue with a red nose? I'm finna show him to you. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Let me blow you up. Oh yeah, that little motherfucker. Nice. Can I can I can you lift it up a little bit? Oh yeah, that bitch is nice. Oh yes, oh yes, okay, okay. You know, I ain't gonna argue with you. Whatever you call it, it is to me. You hear me? <laughs> that motherfucker is nice. How old is that puppy? Three months. Oh yes. Oh, that motherfucker got a good body structure. That's up. You created that? Yeah, you see the muscles. Yeah, bro, you know, listen, you have, you ain't never seen my dogs. I know muscle when I yeah, see them. I see. Yeah, that motherfucker is nice. Ain't it a brindle? Wait, I'm finna show you some more breed. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I ain't, come on, man, go ahead. Do your third digit. Do your third digit. He say blue red nose. Okay. But yes, proud of that. How you gonna tell? So you can tell somebody that's a pretty ass dog. Oh yeah. But no, like I was saying, people kills me when they want to talk about dogs and ain't even showing. Hey, if you ain't hit that thumb up, hit that thumb up. This this monkey foot right here. I had his. I, we had his. Foot. That's English bulldog. No, nah, this a blue merle. That ain't out of the same little that one, is it? No, nah, I tell you, boy, we working with this camp. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, okay. I was confused. <laughs> Two oh, months. Matter of right fact, he only eight weeks. Two Seven. months. <laughs> Two months. <laughs> Two, you're right. You're right. Two months. That little motherfucker is nice. This monkey, smallest of the run. Damn, it is. Yep. Wait, yeah, I'm, you finna, I'm finna go get Biggie. I'll be back to brother. Biggie? <laughs> this is <laughs> But yeah, I've been out here for three years, and dogs still sell. That's what kill me about people that... They talk about these blue dogs and you ain't stopping nothing from selling because all the publicity you give and all the things you say, you don't stop dogs from selling. You actually help people make money. You help people make money because you're not a seller. You ain't selling no dogs. You stuck on your whole two liters. Come on, bro. But I, they, 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 they backyard breeder. Sure. Well, I guess, I guess you must not be, you must be the biggest backyard breeder because uh, you stuck with 14 puppies. This big, this biggie right here, Blue Merle. He the big, he the big brother. Merle? Why do you like he got tri, tri marks? He said tri, Merle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I, listen, I was a little confused. I'm looking at the dog. You know, I don't, yes. Them out the same know. litter? Yeah, that one that little monkey. This the this the big brother, Biggie. And, and you, so you know he he probably be a trial uh carrier. For sure. You know what I'm saying? It's like ghost try. Like that mean like, like you can't it, you can't see that, it. His daddy is. No, but I'm just saying you can't see it. Like sometimes you can't see it in the puppies, and they have puppies, and then they puppy look like little man. 
man, it's a it's and and her and Kona Litter, she had probably three different uh bloodlines. Yeah. Damn. Now this biggie, I did I this biggie from that. Yes. That mother like a rock roller. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. You should have seen his daddy. No, I'm just saying, like, look, listen. I, I my, my brother had my brother owned German rocks. You see them like, legs? that mother look just like a German rock. You see them legs? Yes, I'm telling you, he look, listen, he looked like a rock roller. <laughs> Nigga, look, listen, I wouldn't believe listen, look like his daddy is a rock roller. I'm not saying it is, but I'm just saying like he looks just like a fucking rock roller. Yeah, he look like a rock roller. But nah. They are they are for sale. Hey, hey, I got, hey, look, I got a question for you. So do so you know in 1946, it was already blue pit bulls. I heard you know a lot of people say that they came along in 1990. You you gonna come from an early 2000, right? I'm not even finna debate because no, 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 me, no. I'm telling you, listen, research, listen, research. Say, no, okay, I'm not, so I, I mean, but I'm I'm not take, debate. They all must, yeah, they all must. But people will say every dog is a must, but people will say that the blue dog doesn't exist. And and I'm gonna tell you like this the blue dog back in them days when they were doing the ugly sport wasn't the best, it wasn't like the best. But a lot of people already had put their sauce in their dogs. You get where I'm coming from? Yes, sir. Hit that thumb up if you have it. So they already had put their sauce in it. So, like, for example, my, 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 my boy, mother and father is not blue. His daddy is black and white. His mother is tan and white, right? Because in their genetic genes, nah. you know, if you, mix, if you mix certain blood together and people don't know this, so say like, okay, say if I mix, like you just showed them puppies. Thank you for showing them puppies. I appreciate that because it's going to help me save it off for the same. So if you throw, if you throw, um, um, uh, hold on, I want to have all three of us in here. I think I did it correct. So you say a Jeep, say a Jeep and a press canary. No, so I'm like this. So. Okay, say 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 look, say say okay. So we're gonna use G. So we're gonna say G. We're gonna say Bolio and we're gonna say Nigarina, right? Them three American people will tear your bloodline, right? Okay. Say 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 I mix this this say I mix this G and this Bolio together, right? Then I then I mix this Nigarino in it, right? But then this Nigarino for some reason. That nigga Reno in his bloodline had some Jeep, so it throw back something out of the Jeep bloodline. When the puppy is, you know, the, the puppy is, that I'm breeding with is Jeep and Bolio, but the Jeep part is in the, in the, in the, in like, like in, in the, the first generation, in, in the, the first generation. But then we down, we down to like the fourth or the fifth generation, sixth generation. Like that's how it's back there for. I could get a puppy that. Those the the thing like a lot of people. I was talking to this old head said that back in the day, a lot of blue dogs used to come out, but people were so so afraid of getting you know when they were doing an ugly sport they would they would the puppies wouldn't make it to make it. You get where I'm coming from? Yes, uh, of course. So the puppies wouldn't make it. So they um. There we go. So they 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 like oh prime example. If you know about the American pit bull terrier, black dogs used to get coated out. Black and blue dogs used to get coated out because if being one hundred with you, the 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 old school red nose in the hood, them was them was them was the best dogs that you could ever get. You get where I'm coming from. From your perspective, no, I'm just saying, like, like, okay, if you thinking about the '90s up to the 2000s, when they was when the police was cracking down on that bull crap, them was them was old school red nose that they was taking. You never listen. 
Tell me what time have you seen them take a blue dog out of the yard? A whole bunch of a lit a, a, a yard full of blue dogs. They they weren't that popular back then. Yes, listen, they were listen, they was popular, sir, but they weren't they weren't listen, they was not in the, the night that people they weren't pursuing, they weren't pursuing them much if is that and then they did listen, they did go back hot. In the nineties, they listen. They went cold from they went cold like maybe from nineteen forty six for four years. They did not work. They went cold. They went. They went. And then in nineties, well, no, no, I ain't gonna say that. 80, 84, 84, They 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 start coming back. But you know what? It wasn't it wasn't too many people that had them. You gonna come from there? For sure. But then in the nineties, they brought them back because these dogs that they was breeding, like okay, like they like certain dogs back in the days had skinny legs, so they 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 they, they bones was was breakable. You get where I'm from? Yes, sir. So they brought so I, I do not train breed for no legal purpose. Let me say that before I finish before I go to so they, they put more mass in the dog so the dog can be able to do 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 the task they wanted them to do. You get where I'm coming from? Yes, sir. You don't let so if you get it listen. So if 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 you go get a jack for your core and it's too small, it's gonna break down, right? Right. So you're gonna go get a jack bigger than that can can like you'll get a jack that overweight your car. Like if your car like uh three ton three thousand ton, you'll go get a four thousand ton because you want something to make sure that this car do not collapse down. That's what the, that's what the dog was about. Right. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> so it was, a, it, was a, it was about what weight class you was yes. getting. Yes. It wasn't listen, it wasn't listen. They say nowadays, they say nowadays, it was never about color. It was about the attitude of the dog. It was never about a color. If if your dog was purple and it weighed forty pounds like that person dog, they didn't give a damn. Exactly. It was the it was the weighting. Mm. The it was all about weighting. It was never about a color of a dog. It was about a weighting. The dog had to weigh in the same amount. Because because I seen a rat terrier maul some <laughs> back in the day. Man, let, let me tell you something like this. Let, let, let me explain something to you a lot of people don't get. Ain't no, listen, uh, people will say American people will tear can take down any dog. That's a, sto- that's a story because it's the attitude of the dog. Do you understand where I'm coming from? Yes, sir, I'm listening. Because uh, a man did a man did a uh, study, right? He, t- he had, he had, he was out, he was going around and he videotaping straight dogs, right? And it was pack. It was it was German Shepherd, Pitbull, Rock Riler. Uh, it was all different kind of dog. And when a girl in heat, they would hurt each other over a piece of cat. And, and he, off his test that he did, lot like, like like the pit was the the pit was on top at first. He he was he was supposed to be the stud that bred with him. The stud that ended up breeding with him was the Rock. Do you understand where I'm coming from? So when you think about when you think about that, it's it's the dog. <coughs> it's that attitude of the dog. It's the, you know what? <coughs> A wise old man told me this. It's the man behind the dog. You like if you won't listen. You would not take a person and give a weight pulling dog to a person that don't believe in weight pulling because that, that person's not going to take that dog to the availability of being a weight puller. You know where I'm coming from? Is you still with me, sir? Okay, wait a minute. But you would not take a weight pulling dog to give a weight pulling dog. You would not give a working dog to a person that's not going to work it. Like, why would you listen? Why would you give a great day that come from a stock of great day that ran used to run, runs in, in a champion weight uh champion 
um, Great Dane. Why would you give a person a champion duck hunting dog if it's not going to take the dog uh, duck hunting? Like you got, like you got to be careful with what you give to a person because it, the dog ain't so messed up that people take these dogs and they don't, they actually don't even understand the dog because you do not take an American pit bull terrier and do not take it out and run. Well, it's a high energy dog. American pit bull terrier is a high energy dog. I don't, I don't care how you look at it. It's a high energy dog. The dog is built of energy. It is built of power. It is built of, of, you know, have you ever heard the saying, if you leave a dog, if you, you leave American people with terrier, you eat a house. If you leave American people with terrier in the cage, it'll come out the cage. That's because it has so much energy. It, when you leave a dog like that or uh, in a cage and you really have a high energy dog, you're gonna know you have a high energy dog. Second of all, second of all, when you have American people with terrier that you say is gang, you cannot lock it in no crate because that mug is going to listen real listen real american pit bull terriers that hog hunt or anything like that once they like okay for example when you watch these other people that go take these dog dog hunt once they take that dog out that crate that dog is ready to work it's a sign of workiness you know what i'm saying it's not a sign of playing it's not a sign of happiness it's a sign that like that's just like greyhound when they come out they they them them them, them cage them them candles that they in before they get to running they they once that door open up is 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 joy i never seen until i got on youtube i see a lot of uh, a dude on the dog that when he opened up the cage the dog act like the ground was on fire you that is is, is neglect towards that dog but you said, but that same person say he the best in the game. But at the end of the day, how are you the best in the game when you are the worstest in the game? You don't do nothing. You do. see when you when I, when I say do something. If you watch my videos, I walk my dog. I play with rope with my dog. I let them play with each other. That 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 is doing something. But first thing when he when he heard that because he he don't want to do nothing is I'm trying to send him in jail. When I tell you, sir, oh go walk your dog. That's not a legal purpose. It's not nothing against the law. But only way you you breaking the law if it's say leash and you don't have a leash. If you you're not breaking the law if you're doing walking your dog. It's nothing wrong with walking your dog. At the end of the day, when you walk your dog, you build up your dog energy. You build up your dog wind. You build, you build up your dog heart. You know what I'm saying? You give your dog something to, to actually help it live longer. When you leave these dogs in these crates and you're not doing nothing with them, a dog get depressed. Like, in prime example is, when you, when you own dogs that is in the category of the word bulldog or terrier. Them are high energy dogs. American Stafford Terrier, American Pitbull Terrier, Boston Terrier, Terrier Terrier, American Bulldog, uh, French Bulldog, uh, you know, Bulldog, Bulldog, uh, Boxer, uh, you know, just just all them dogs. Even even when you get a Doberman Pitcher, Doberman Pitcher, German Shepherd, uh, Lab. Um, Roddy, you know what I'm saying? The best, uh, the best hunting dog to me is a German short hair pointer. Okay. I listen. I don't have nothing to say about this, sir. That's not. That's not. You're not gonna get me to say. Oh, you know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, when it comes to dogs, I understand dogs. I understand dogs. You know, because if you treat that dog right, I wouldn't care. Like they say, oh, American people would tear, would not attack, would not attack a person. But if you do your research, a lot of the blood that they run in that day was peeper biters. Right. They, they, they like. That's the they, narrative. That's the narrative they carry from what you just uh, put out there, keeping the dog in the cage. You know what I mean? Yes. All that building up all that aggression. Don't know nothing. Don't smell. 
Don't mm-hmm. smell too many other people. Of course, that dog gonna come out biting human. Yes, sir. You got. You got. Listen. See, back in the days. Okay, back in the days when it when they were doing they were doing them dogs was handled by different people, so they was not like. That's why the people buy this. If if, if the people buy the about like oh, prime example is. I get nanny. I can show you the most scariest looking dog, but the friendliest dog. But yes. On call, he he'll go crazy. I'm gonna show him to you. Now this the daddy of the of the one of the of the red though. No. Okay. But at the at, at the end of the day, it's like you gotta you gotta you gotta be able to control your dogs. You know, and it's so many law. It's so many laws. Sit, sit. That's him sitting. That's him sitting right here. Oh yeah. damn! Yes, sir. He's a big boy. Yeah. Yes, okay. he's a big boy. Okay. Come over a little bit. You ain't in the camp. Okay, there you go. Oh yes, yes. Now he he finna be three. Yeah, you can tell. You can tell he ain't no pup. You can tell he ain't no pup. You, you see his face. Yes, yes. Listen, nice looking man. This, this the daddy. Yeah, this nice looking man. I I can see where his son or daughter get that looking for him now. Yeah, that's a big boy. Yeah, that's a big now boy. that red one I just showed you. This the this the this the daddy. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. The the other oh, brindle, the brindle, uh, the brindle. Now, now he a blue. Oh, he is. Yeah. Wait, he's a blue. He's a blue brindle. He got blue in him. This the one, the press canary in the G. Right here. Okay. In your face. You see him? Wait, you mix the press canary with a G? This, this, this right here. This what this what he is. He got a little press in him. G. He do? Yeah, you see him? This him. You know, they would say that's a band dog. You see him? You see him, don't you? Yeah, but you know, they would say that's a band dog if you do the if you do like off of, off of the way that you said he bred, they would say a band dog. The uncle, I just took his his son. I just gave to the to the uncle that gave me him when he was a puppy. Okay. So he, I just gave him a free puppy. His son, his 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 son. His, yeah. Okay. 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 That's what's up. Go on, boy, go on, boy. Yeah, that dog look good. Go on. Now I'm finna show you a blue Layla. Now, now this Hercules right here. Oh, who is his daddy? This moss, this moss, he a blue laylac. No he worthy, well, who he, he come he from? Up. He going on two years old. No, where did he, who is his saying damn? His daddy from Indiana. Okay, okay, okay. You see him? Yeah, I do see him. See how short he is and he going on too. Yeah, 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 he's, he, he's, he's, he's very standard. Look like he a standard size. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Now here go the girl. Now here go the mama of that red one. Now this the mama. Wait, what? This the mama. Damn, I thought you picked the boy back up. <laughs> no, this the mama. Are they okay, okay. The first. So you bring, so you bring the two brindles together. Right. They get blue. They'll give you some blue. Okay, okay. Because it. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. That makes sense. Off, <laughs> off, off with what you said, how they bred, that makes sense. So now I got a boy, a boy full-blooded blue laylac. Then I'm going to run with the girl puppies from Titus and Bella. Okay, so look, so look, since, since you speaking about this, so, you know, um, my boy, hold on, let me see if I, I'm going to try to, uh, hold on. Now I can I can oh. show you uh now I'm gonna show you a boy farm from from I did if I'm gonna show you hold on hold on let me uh let me try this hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on uh how do I do that hold on I'm gonna show you because I'm gonna take I'm gonna take him where where I'm thinking about taking him. I'm thinking about a girl. 
Wow. American people with I'm gonna buy a female American people with Terry. Now, I'm gonna show, gonna... show you. Now, now, remember that, remember that, uh, that, that, uh, blue, that blue nose with that red brittle. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I can't see it because I'm on a different thing. I'm trying to pull up something for you. No, I ain't, I, I ain't showed them. Yeah, I was waiting for you to show. I was just okay, okay. I'm just trying to go because I don't want you to be, I don't want you to be sure. Me something I can't see you. You come from that's how no, real I, was, I am. I was just explaining to you. Remember the, the first Brit uh Breno Red one I showed you before yeah. the uh hoodie. now I'm showing you the boy to the other brother that I just sent to my uncle. When you see this Fawn's color from that litter, this the one okay, I on. got out. You're gonna be like, okay, you're gonna see where I was going. Now, this is what I got after the, the two brittle stripes I just showed you. When I show you this one, this is the one I'm keeping. Hold on. I got you, bro. I'm trying to show you something. I got patience. I got patience. Okay. Appreciate it. I appreciate you coming in here, too, bro. You hear me? I like have, yeah. listen, I like talking about dogs. This is what I, this, Man, I this what like. Hold on. Okay. So. Hold on. So this, hold on, let me do it like this. This is a litter, this litter right here I had, right? What's up? This male right here, I kept him. He's considered a blue fawn. His, his muzzle is still gray, right? right? So I'm going to get, so I'm going to um purchase a black american people interior but um, i'm gonna i'm gonna take her breed her twice but the first time i'm breeding her i'm breeding her to hold on let me you said i thought breeding. you said a male no i'm male. getting a female oh, you said no, that, that is a male then my i only that is a male. Go get a female yeah i'm going to get a female and I'm gonna breed her to. I'm gonna show you which one I breed her to first, cause and I'm gonna explain to you what what it's gonna do. I got this from a real breeder, and somebody that's been doing it for many years that associate with. Okay, hold on. Oh, well, this okay, create. Hold on. Now this this my male that they say not American people terrier. This is his sight. So the two dogs at the top, that's his father, the black and white one. That's his mother. Okay. That's his mother. Okay, hold on. Let me let me do one more thing. One more thing, and then I'm gonna, I'll let you get to what you think. I'm gonna show you the male I'm breeding. The male I'm gonna breed. Uh, my boy too. I mean, my female too. I don't know why I keep on calling her a male. Hold on, where is he at? How did that pass that boy up? I call him. I call him the one I got in my lap now. I call him Rock. He three months. I got appointment for they Pablo shots and the other temperament shots. You don't get you don't get a Pablo shot yourself. I, I can, but you know what I'm saying? Hey. No, you just mark it. Lit. You get a piece of paper and you mark it down like, like the, the veterinary did it. And you mark listen, it down. Listen, like listen to what I'm telling you. Hey, we do this. <laughs> okay, I'm just saying, bro, bro, look, I ain't saying you don't. I'm just asking hey, the question. Hey when, I, hey, when I say I'm taking them to the vet, we know people in the vet. That don't mean the cost going to be vet cost. Oh, okay, okay. So this male is what I'm breeding the black girl to first. And he is, he's uh 75% American pit bull Terry, 25% master. I see so you when, when you have, I see you when you was walking down one around the pond. Yeah, so when it when it comes to him, once I put once I put a hundred percent American pit bull terrier, the puppy's gonna it, it's only gonna have it's 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 gonna make the American pit bull terrier more. 
in the dogs than anything because they they daddy is 75 percent they mom is 100 percent american people will tear it so i'm gonna see what I, i'm 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 gonna see what I get out of there. For sure. I'll but I'm getting you. a black. I'm, I'm trying to get a black girl. Her mom, the mom is like black and white. Okay, now I'm back. Okay, now you can show me what you want to show me. I'm back where you at. No, I was letting you finish. Go ahead. You was talking. No, so um, the mom is black and white. The dad is tan. The daddy is uh tan, tan and white, tan and white. Like okay, for example, it's like my my dog, the my uh blue dog daddy, but it's it's fully like it's it's fully black and white, like it, it you know it look like all the rest of the black and white people. Cause I work, you know, so it, it just it just the way that you how you do it. But yeah, I'm about to get a new female. Uh, her mom should be having her by the end of this month. Or uh, the falling of next month, so you know I gotta wait eight weeks. I, I well, I'm trying to get the puppy at five weeks, you know, because I prefer to get, I prefer to get the puppy at five weeks. You feel? Yes, I do. Three months. Hey, that you know what that boy look like? <laughs> hey, hey, that boy look like a red boy. <laughs> This blue, blue frog. I know, but because of his, the way his ears made and the way he's his uh his, his 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 look, you know what I'm saying? Look, that's the point. Hey nanny, I'm the creator. Hey, listen, that's the point that they that's the point that they don't understand when they be saying it like that oh blue them blue dogs ain't pit bulls and they they bullies. It's like no, they look more, they look more like like they look more like they ancestors the other dog do. See, the reason why I showed you him, because I'm keeping him right. Now you yes, remember, sir. remember remember them ears. When I show you him again in a month, remember when I get them ears cropped, remember he's not gonna look the same. So remember that face. Like this. Hold on, let me do this. Look, like this. This 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 would kill me. Watch this. Hold on. Hold on, I got another one. Hold on. Hold on. Shit. And I'm gonna pass him. No, oh, there we go. Like this. You see the muscles on that boy? Can you see him? Hello? Yeah, I can see him. Okay, hold on. Let me go back then. Just imagine, just imagine how his puppy's gonna look. You see, how, you see, how he got he got a red nose. Yes, sir. Before listen, before I told people he, he was a band dog, people used to think he was a pit bull. But guess what? When I get through, when I get through putting my 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 sauce together, and I get through doing what I'm doing, see, this is what people don't understand. I am making my own stock of dogs that like my puppies my my folk puppies that i sold bro that nobody complained about them that's that that's the point that you, that's the point of the game is you get where i'm coming from What's up? when you get satisfied customers that's what you look for like people like oh we gonna do another breed like like i told my I, I, I ain't breeding my girl i'm about to buy i'm about to buy another female i'm gonna take her first i'm gonna take her first to tiger and then I'm gonna take her to Max. See, once I take her to Max, because Max is a American people with terrier, and then I take, I have my 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 um, my band dogs. That's basically more American people with terrier than anything. Then I have my American people with terrier bloodline. You know what I'm saying? Man, I'm gonna show I'm gonna show you something else, man. Go ahead.
But yeah, hey, if you ain't hit that thumb up, hit that thumb up if you in the building. Appreciate it. Now, now this JoJo want the arm and mitt for her puppies. That's a bulldog, right? Yes. You see Is that a name? bulldog? You see a name of Bully, short. Man, that, that, that dog got more bulldog than anything in it. You hear me? You see how short she is? Yeah, she's look like say bulldog. It's JoJo. You know, JoJo look like a bulldog. Micro bully, nano. Come here, Paula. Come here. Come here. See, look, there, there go bulldog right here. Remember them puppies I showed you earlier? Yeah, you see this bulldog? Yeah, that's a yeah. That's what I say. Like she got a that that she got that you know on that bulldog look. You remember? You remember? Remember them puppies I showed you earlier? Here go the mama. This Kona. Damn, she little. This Kona. Hold on, my my phone keep on. I mean the computer. That's Kona. Merle. And what yeah. you bring her with? With Biggie, another bully, the boy at my son's house. Okay, 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 okay. The puppies I showed you, Biggie, that's the mama, the daddy, Biggie okay. at my son's house. Now I'm finna go. I'm finna go get Panther. So, 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 do she has? Is she a uh, breed on her own, or do you got to do all the other stuff? We got papers, and everything. You got to pay top. No, 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 sir, I'm not, sir, I'm not, sir, I'm not talking about papers. I'm talking about like did did you have to um did the male get to breed with her or did you have to uh, stimulate her to, like did you have to do the uh the whole the whole fashion line we ain't playing you see what's going on man this this a real no thing. I'm not asking I don't know <laughs> shit she's short some people don't even some people just breed the dog uh I'm gonna give you I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna send you the link to the kennel all right put it in the back chat come here, Damn, she like a bulldog. This the mean girl. So I just showed you two girls. This the third girl. Actually, four. This the third. See her? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a puppy too. No, nah, they about all of the 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 mama the corner two and uh, JoJo and Panther. They going on like one. Oh, uh, so they what they pockets or 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 um mic uh, what they consider pockets? Micro pockets and nano. I heard them work. I heard them hard to breed. Hey, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Take so time. do do all them do natural uh, breed? No, they don't. Nope. We not. Y'all don't, don't do natural don't, breed? I don't, I don't think anybody else do. You know what I'm saying? They do simulation. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. I'm, that's what I was asked earlier. No, I'm talking about, I, I answered that one from that first question. Okay, okay. And then I showed you these two, and then you repeated the question, and I'm I'm like, ever, yes, sir. Okay, okay, okay. You know, I got to list. I got to ask list. I got to ask because I'm listening. I don't know nothing. Listen, I don't know nothing about that. I, listen, I was born in 1984. All I know, growing up, I didn't think it was no other dog but German Shepherds, Rock Rollers, and Pit Bulls. I didn't know these other dogs. I grew up around nothing but American Pit Bull Terriers. I remember American Pit Bull Terriers when I was <coughs> six, seven years old, and I'm 39 years old. So you get where I come from? That's all. That's all I used to mess with: short staffers, short terriers. You so know look, get that thumb up. 
like you said, you know, you start saying different things, and when you able to do those things, you uh you do those things, you know. But you know what, dog, I like. I ain't gonna lie to you. I like 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 that's why I'm trying to create my own my own band, dog. Uh, bloodline, because my boy, like, like, listen, fuck with my boy. You rather run into an 18 wheeler? Cause he, cause he has listen. He has the mind wise of American people interiors. When I mean with the shaking, like he loves to shake. So he loves. That's his favorite thing is to shake. Right. You give him a rope, he gonna shake it. What's up? He, he gonna shake it. He's very gore dog. And st- he's very gore dog. You know what I'm saying? So, like me, I'm the kind of dude. I'm not stuck into one breed of dog, but I want to like I do want my own bloodline. Of band dogs and my own terriers out there. You feel what I'm saying? I'm listening. That's how you say what, sir? I said I'm listening. Yeah, that's what I want. I mean, that's what I want. I want my own, you know what I'm saying? Because one thing, one thing I never did was try to follow a trim. You know, like when I because when I bought my boy blue, I knew it was gonna be so much problems with him being American pit bull terrier but did I care no because if you look at his papers and pedigree it, it'll tell you that he's 100% American pit bull terrier it's not no unknowns in his bloodline when you when you purchase any of them uh micros nano bullies you're gonna be able to when you purchase no, see, if, I, if, if I'm going for a bully I, 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 no. if I'm going for a bully no, I, I was gonna, I was gonna, what I was going to say is when you purchase any from this kennel you're going to be able to go uh-huh. back years and, and and history on the paperwork to see where these puppies mama and daddy and grandmama them and granddaddy came from okay 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 yeah like i mean like like that that's the same thing with my uh dog my puppy that i sold the uh five i sold no no problems with the customer because they got to see papers and pedigree because they they spending their money you gonna come from if you're not spending listen i'm not no dude on youtube gonna show you no pay or no pedigree, and you're not spending no money. This is like me going to show you my my deed to my house, and you don't want to buy my house or or the title to my cards. You don't want to buy. Why am I? What am I showing you something that you don't want to purchase? You gonna come from? What's if you want, to, if you gonna purchase, you can see whatever you want to see because you buy it from this stock. You you get where come from? Like, for example, with when you go to Walmart, they, Man, I don't mean to they don't show you. Off. How much they spent and how much you made off of nothing. You, you you just buy what you when you buy, you get to see, you know what I'm saying? If you buy it to the company, you get to see how much revenue they make sure. and what you know what I'm saying. But in the dog game, people feel like you're supposed to show me your paperwork or you don't have paperwork. When at the end of the day, let me explain something to you. I've been on this since I've been on YouTube from the beginning. People say dogs don't have papers. It's not hard to register a dog with papers. Do you understand what I'm saying? So, you, so people saying people dogs don't have paper. That's stupid that day because it's so many different registries out here that were registered dog. Yes, sir. I'm about I'm about to walk these dogs, let them go out and use the bathroom. I'm gonna let you continue your show. Thanks for letting me come up and display the dogs that I have, man. Keep doing your thing, man. Peace. P- appreciate it, sir. But back to what I was saying. Um, no, I mean, damn, what was I saying? He threw me off a little bit. Oh, my God, a cage back, cage back. Uh, uh, oh, I'm breed, I'm breeding my dogs. I, I want to breed them. And shoot, if you want to buy them, you can buy them. If you don't, you don't. I mean, I'm not going to cry over people buying dogs for me because I have had a problem because. I am a hustler, not a drug hustler. I am a hustler. I know how to sell. When I my lives have not sell myself to make get customers. I know how to dogs. I know how to train dogs. I know how to sell the products that I have because at the end of the day, you got to be business in this. You got to be business in it. If you're not business in it, you ain't going nowhere. You're not going nowhere. And a lot of people call themselves business people, and they really not business people. They not business people because you worry about dogs and you not selling no dogs. Don't make sense. 
You think I'll be on y'all pla- you think I'll be on this platform talking about other people's dogs and I ain't sold no dog. First thing be going to my mind is first thing will be going to my mind is trying to sell my stock. Not worrying about your stock. Your stock is not gonna make me no money. At the end of the day, this, the people worry about my dogs and sit on their platform talk about my dog, but at the end of the day, I had six puppies. Okay, we're gonna say six. If I sold, if I sold five, I could have sold seven. What's the difference? Because I a person wanted to buy my my keep, and I told him my keep is not for sale. My keep is not for sale. Nope, Max was not for sale. Now Mo, yeah, I ended up selling Mo. Mo was supposed to be a keeper, but hey, person begged me, and I was like, you know, I got the dad and I got a brother. I can repeat, I can remake him again. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, at the end of the day. I do me in this dog game, and I, 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 I'm telling anybody, all the people that there do you. If you worry about worrying about what people on YouTube think about you and your stock, and what you do with your stock, and what your stock has, you and you ain't gonna get for life. You ain't gonna get for life because you know. Prime example, I see a lot of people talk about the blue dog. They've been on the map since 1946, and they say they know American people with Terry, but they don't know everything about American people with Terry because they say, oh, I read books and, and I do research. Well, if you did research, you wouldn't say Pitcher was not a pit bull. You wouldn't say all these old timers that started the American people with Terry dogs are not pit bull, they're bulldogs. You try to give this credit to a bulldog and try to turn bulldog into gang dogs. Where do you do that at? Where do you do that at? When do you turn a bulldog into a gang dog? Yes, the term bulldog was put on American pit bull terrier. Some people don't comprehend it. That doesn't mean that you're American bulldog. Yeah, that that's that right there. That's a bulldog. That's a bulldog. Pitcher was a bulldog. No, pitcher was a pit bull. Pitcher was a pit bull that you want to take credit and try to give it to the bulldog. Your bulldogs are never add up to pitcher. Your bulldog ain't even standard as pitcher. Your bulldog ain't even workable as pitcher. You know what I'm saying? So think about that when you speak about the dog. That your dog's not going to never, ever be in a category of pitcher. All you guys sit up there and talk shit about Kobe dogs and what Kobe dogs ain't. You you will never be known as like John P. Kobe. You'll never be in the book like John P. Kobe. You would listen. You listen. One thing I say with John P. Kobe, he met all the old time. They took pictures together. Show me a picture you took since you've been in the game since the 50s and the 40s and the 80s and all that. Show me some picture of you with some other dog men. You can't. You can't. You won't. Only thing you can do is run your mouth about everybody else's dog. You sit on YouTube and you talk about Tom, Harry, Gerald, and everybody else's dog, and you got 14 puppies that you ain't sold. And you had 15, and one would have died, you would have still, you still, listen, your next channel, your next uh, thing should be, don't talk about nobody, dog. Say, look, hey, y'all support me. Y'all, y'all dig me. Y'all listen to what I say. Go ahead and buy my stock. I need you to buy my stock. My stock is not being sold. These are dogs are getting two years old. I got some that's two years old. Yes, they're not. They're not people aggression or animal aggression. They 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 crate. They crate. They, they the only thing they're gonna do is be in a crate. I've been having a crate for their whole life. They know how to be in a crate. You can put two dogs in the crate. You can put three in the crate because my dogs uh, adapt to that. Sell what? Figure out a sell dog rather than worry about. What the hell, what nanny dog dog is, what everybody else dog is, what this, Frenchie this, this, that, who it all this, South Africa, uh, um, what, Lane Lane dogs and this dog and that dog and this dog and that dog. Where about selling your dog? That's what you, your biggest thing should be is selling your dog. You remember when, when I had puppies, you said everybody was talking all this stuff 
I didn't care what nobody was saying because at the end of the day, salute, I got to make money. I don't listen. At the end of the day, do I care about what your opinion is? Nope. Do, do, do your opinion matter to me? Nope. Do I give a damn about what you think about? Nope. Is you, Listen, it's moolah, baby. It's money. You're not making no money. You can sit up there and tell everybody all that bull crap of people ain't got enough money for your dog. No, nobody wants your dog. Because, listen, if they buy micros and pockets and XLs and fluffy uh, Frenchies and and um, this dog and that dog, it's somebody. Everybody ain't broke. Somebody got money to buy your dog. They don't want your dogs. Quit trying to make it seem like, oh, your credit. Oh, listen. If you got, if a person got to put your dog on that credit, that tells you that they don't have money for your dog. You don't need no credit to buy no to to sell no dog. Did I use people credit? No, I use they. Move, I need money. I don't need no credit. I don't need no finance company. You, you, you we we find that dog. Not a rep. Listen, not a rep of breeder that like you that has a wait list. She ever have to ask anybody about no dog. But hey, at the end of the day, do you do it? Yes. Do you sit there hate on the people dog and not making a dime or a nickel? Yes. It's so sad, bro. Like I, I sit back and like this YouTube stuff. I sit back and I'm wa I'm watching how people talk all that and they stuck on freaking puppies. Every day you gotta talk about somebody dog and hey, talk about tell us about your dog. Tell us what what do your what do your American people interior brings to the American people interior table. Nothing. Your American people interior doesn't bring nothing to the table. Your male cannot reproduce. He's a dove male. He cannot, listen, this kid boy body, we cannot say that your girl was not in heat because you stuck the bulldog right behind it. So guess what? That means your boy is bad to the American people interior. He is a waste of a dog. You call that man killer, and he can't even reproduce. You've been having that dog for two years, and he had one litter, and you still feed him. You need to take him. Listen, but you worry about repro breeders and people mislabeling. You need to take that dog. You need to go call the breeder and say, look, kill ain't, kill ain't gang. Killer is friendly. Look, you can take Killer on your yard. I spent my money on Killer. Killer, I did not reproduce, but you too busy. Rather than calling, you call the registries. And tell them that they mislabeling dogs, but you won't call the breeders. And then it's kill poor body. You tell everybody about this story about this blue dog that you bought, but you never ever call out the name of the kennel place that sold you the blue dog. So people won't buy the blue dog. But you won't do that. But you'll talk about it. Yeah, they sold me a blue dog in 19 and in 2009. They bought I bought a dog that they said it was Eli and it, it, it was blue, but you'll call out everybody else kennel besides the kennel who actually sold you a fucking dog that you said one of the people, but you won't speak about that. You will not open up your big fat ass mouth and talk about that, but you'll quickly talk about me, Hulk, and everybody else, but you won't expose the motherfucker who sold you that bullshit ass dog that you call the bullshit. Then now the dog they sold you was a bully, but back then it was an Amstaff. Make up which fucking dog it was that they sold you in 2009. You are, uh, we don't lie over here. We tell the truth. You told the truth. You didn't tell the truth. Lady was not fit. You did, You made up a whole motherfucking account and a Facebook thing and said, I said, buddy, lady fixed. I can't breathe with it. First of all, I don't know Doug Biz and on no Facebook about no fucking dog. Now tell me that. I don't even do it. I listen, I got IG, whatever, Instagram, whatever the fuck that shit is y'all call it. And I don't know Doug Biz and on that. My business, I I don't even really duck business on YouTube about dog. Because you don't need to know what I do and what how much money I make off my dog. Because guess what? You ain't making a dime or nickel off of that shit that's sitting in them crates in your mom's yard. We we gonna have a, a 20 set kennel set up. We finna sand it out. All the shit you said, we finna redo the sheds and all that. You ain't did shit. And I always tell my we tell the truth. I say, listen, you been waiting on, hold on, blue two years old. You been waiting on, um, what was it? 
South African, uh, whatever the dog that used, I, I put my money on there. I always know, so I always know COVID it is. So, but everybody else getting overseas dogs except you, but you don't lie. But you don't lie. You tell the truth. We tell the truth over here. Oh, Henry, Eric, now we tell the truth. No, you don't. All you do is lie. You tell everybody, you guys, whatever happened to the dogs in New York? Whatever happened to your pet? Whatever happened to your pet store in New York? What happened to the dogs in New York? You don't even talk about it no more, but you tell the truth. But you tell the truth. How can that be the truth if that's all lies? You, you still ain't told people, me and Nanny Dog do not get along because I wanted to breed Grizzly Bird and Lady and Nanny Dog said no. And I said again, no. I still listen. You gave Grizzly Bird up or wherever he is because you could not breed with Lady. But then the kill part about it is you always talking about, I create dogs. I create dogs. Okay. I remember you took that month and bred it with the bulldog, and you still ain't bred that helpful. That half was damn near what, about three years old, three, four years old, three or four years old. She had a little puppy jet. So you create dogs that nobody wants. Nobody wants. Okay, I, I, I create dogs. At the end of the day, you do not, you created dogs. All these dogs that you created, you don't have no stock of it, and you don't even have, listen. I created Max. When I breed Max, I'm going to keep one of his things. I'm going to keep my blood on my yard. I don't give a damn what nobody wants to buy. It's my blood I created. You want it or you don't want it. But at the end of the day, you sit on the platform and say you create dogs, and then you tell people they can take any kind of dog and breed with any kind of dog and call it what they want to. Who the hell is going to buy a dog that they don't know what the hell? Listen, you cannot just take a dog and breed with another dog and try to sell the stock straight out the door. Because at the end of the day, you don't know if the dog's going to look like bulldog or pit bull or master or hound. You don't know. So quit telling people that bull crap because you whack, you are, you as the dumbest person on YouTube telling people you can create your own breed. Who's going to buy dogs for five or seven thousand dollars that doesn't have a look that they know? They don't, people don't know what these dogs don't look like. I got real, I got Johnson Bulldogs and I got a Dick's Bulldog and you didn't sell one of them Bulldogs, one of them Bulldogs. You didn't sell none of them. You, you didn't sell one Bulldog. Tell me why, they, tell me why you could not sell Bulldog. Huh? Okay, tell me why you, listen, you haven't sold a dog since I met you on YouTube and I've been on YouTube going on three, or either three years, we're going to say three years, three years, you haven't sold one dog. You got on the internet and told everybody that somebody paid fifteen thousand dollars for a dog that you told everybody he don't get along with other dogs and he bite people. So who bought a dog? Who took Grizzly Bird out of a kennel that bit bite people? First of all, you said you say you sent them to the UK. You sent the dog to the UK and you did not introduce them to the dog you did they never got to be around the dog they did the dog listen so who put grizzly bird on the chain who put grizzly bird in a kennel if he was that much a, a that much by people nobody is that but we don't lie over here we tell the truth we tell the truth that we tell the truth that yeah yeah that's all you talk about but you don't tell none of the truth because i want to i want to see your other breeds of dog that i've been waiting to see for three years Three years you've been you've been talking about these other breeds of dogs, and then when somebody listen, and then when somebody asks you to show the dog, we had bull master back in the day. No, you telling people you can't tell people that you can sell them a bull master from back in the day. But you know, some I do realize you do. You tell people you have a waiting list to for you to find somebody else breeder that's selling a puppy for about two or three grand, and then you add you add three grand to another person breed a, a dog. And you sell them they puppy. You sell them they puppy. But you, you your, your registry doing so good and you ain't listen. You ain't nothing going good in your life. You know why ain't nothing going in your life good in your life? Because you keep on hating on people that God blessing. How do you think he's blessing you when you hate on people? You still you gotta think about it, bro. Look, 
you worry about everybody and they dog, and you the guy live with your mama. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. You live with your old bird, bro. You mama's baby. Mama's baby, 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 baby. You mama's baby. I take care of my mama. Get that bullshit out of here, bro. Nobody buys that shit. Nobody buys that shit. I don't buy it. And you ain't gonna sell it to me. Talking about you. Uh, I'm a I'm a I'm I'm a I'm a replica breeder. Hey come on, bro. You hey listen, you so you so messed up to the dog community that you sit on there and you'll say American Pit Bull Cherry is the best. Then you'll say American Pit Bull Cherry ain't the best. You talk about all these American people with terriers. You ain't even listen. You sit on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube, and you criticize people. And then so they get on you. They hate no me. Listen, my dog, my one set of dogs, my blue dogs, is the reason that you say everybody else hating on you. You the, listen, you the big with people that didn't even own. They didn't even own pit bulls, but you believe they did, so you argue with them. One question I always ask you, you never answer. How you create American staff interior? Tell me what two dogs make American staff interior. You never answer that question. I made my own way and step by amp step bullies. Then you listen. I remember one day you called the registry, right? And it was so fucking funny to me. You told him, you said, um, I created my own dog. They stabbed with the legs like, um, sir, we can't raise them because them two, them two dogs don't go together. Oh, they hate no me. They hate no me. They let them, they let them raise the pit bull and, and this and that. And they, they paper hanging and, and they mislabeling dog. But they, they show them like, listen, they show them mislabeling your dog. They don't even listen. No registry, but your registry take your dog. No registry. So you keep on telling people, breed your dog, and I'm going to register your dog. Use a 40 or 50-year-old heavy set dude who dad died for quite had a cardiac arrest. And you think high blood pressure and heart attack don't run in your blood out. Who's going to run your registry when you die? All these dumb dudes think, oh, he died. I'm going I'm to run it. Nope. He dead self. If, listen. Ain't man one of y'all he ever gave. Listen, he knowing that he want to keep his blood alive and, and all that. I know the, the the fat black ugly dude on a a bulldog. I know the the look the little yag boy, the look the look the rainbow, the his little boyfriend who read for him, who read for him. I know he on a bulldog, but why them two dog, them two dudes? You got you listen, you got all these males. And your two partners that always talk this stuff about me on Bulldog. Why you don't give them a Bulldog? Why you don't give them a Bulldog? Why you don't give them a Bulldog? Why they don't? If, if I make these dudes seem like clowns and they, they breed like the one dude bred a dog, because I don't I don't get why they think you breed a Bulldog with a, with a, with a, uh, what is it? They always, they use this word and say that. Oh, they messing up. The, 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 the bullies messing up. But why do y'all take bulldogs and breed with bullies? If the bully if the bully messing up the dog game, you bred a bulldog, a bulldog and a bully together. Your partner bred a bully and a bulldog together. And y'all call them bulldog bullies. Bulldog bullies. Wait, wait, wait. Say it again, Nanny Dog. You tripping. Bulldog bullies. But you say the bully messing up the game, but y'all taking these bullies and bring with y'all bulldog. Because guess what? At the end of the day, y'all don't have the eyes to be like, oh, well, well, Johnson did it and Kobe did it and the, the, the Doma Pitcher dude did it and the German Shepherd did, dude did it. And then they get what? Everybody ain't meant to be a trainer. Everybody ain't meant to be a breeder. Everybody ain't got the eyes to see how to breed a dog together. Everybody is, some people is kennel blind. They cannot see nothing. And you one of the kennel blind ones. You kennel blind. You don't see that you're mixing dogs together that don't go together. You do not take a bulldog and mix it 
with a bully who already a bully has a body of big bones and has a way of getting up to a big size. Excuse me. So why would you take a bully and mix it with a bulldog? Because you don't have the eyes for it. You do see at the end of the day, then you call it yeah, yeah, for some reason, y'all call it the breed, the two breed together. Who gonna put on a dog uh vet paper? Oh, this a the vet never gonna be confused. Is they bring in a bully or a bulldog? No, they said it's a bully bulldog. Uh, what is a bully bulldog? Mm -hmm. Wait and see how the dog look when he comes into the vet office. You tell everybody, I'll take my dog to get hip displays and, 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 and all that. Okay. Your 15 puppies haven't had hip displays. Your 15 puppies ain't seen. No, no, 14. Sorry, sorry. RIP to the puppy that passed away. Your 14 puppies haven't seen the veterinarian. Your 14 puppies ain't had a uh, hip displays. Your dogs ain't did nothing that you brag on. Brag on. Then this kill puppy out here. You've been having pit bulls for many years, but you showed the two dogs that you bought from everybody else paperwork. You won't never. You, now, listen. You say, I need paper from 1995. Your daddy was breeding. Your dad, you said your daddy died with 03. So your daddy was breeding Bulldog in 05. I mean, I mean 95, sir. Don't try to take your daddy documents and show it as you were doing it, bro. That's sad. You sad, bro. You sad. Anytime you take your daddy documents and try to put it like you was in the dog game, when at the end of the day, you say you was in the army, you was uh you was in school. You was all this bullshit, and you was and you was breeding and all this stuff, bro. How did you listen? If you supposed to be a, a, a veterinary assistant, when did you when did you take your schoolwork? Then you say you went to school to be a uh a, a, a dog trainer. Okay, when did you do that? Then you say you got it. Uh, you got a uh, a master and a master and um supervisor or, or, or management. So all is that you went to school and you would, and you were doing all that you were dealing with dog and going to school. Boy, that's full of bull crap, bro. Yeah, but I, we don't lie over it. We tell the truth. We tell the truth. Lie out of fucking talk. We tell the truth. Uh, yeah, they, they, they be. Uh, then I heard you one day, right? Somebody said to me, you said on Valentine's Day and dog, every man that got a woman, I don't want a woman. So what do you want? You want a man? What do you want a whole leg? Because I didn't get how you was dogging. You always dogging female. They're gonna take you for child part your money and all that. Well, guess what the kill part about is? You said people that's married is dumb. You said your mother and father was married. So your mama dumb and your daddy dumb. That's what you just did. You realize when you were trying to assault us, you were assaulting your parents that was married. <coughs> make it make sense. Make it make sense. You assaulted. Your mother and your father. You sit on vibes that day and try to dog me and everybody else. And your, and your mom and daddy been married. <laughs> you sit on the internet and try to dog me and everybody else. And your your mom was married to your daddy. You know that, right, Dum Dum? See, you don't. I don't think you be thinking about the stuff that you be saying. We. We tell the truth over here. We won't lie to y'all. We won't lie to y'all. We own 70 different breeds of dogs. That's a lot. I didn't want to breed with nanny dog, dog. That's a lot. All the lies you tell. All the lies you tell. All right, all right, the pit bull got caught with the with the before you did your DNA test, you said on this is what kid me about you. You sit on these platforms, on your little platform, your little platform, because you got 20,000 followers, and you see on, on a good day, you might see 300, 500 out of 20,000. That don't make sense. You won't even see a thousand, but hey, who's just who's just count the numbers of the people? But you know, everybody wanted everybody want a club chase off me. Nope. Because I wouldn't know about the African dude. I wouldn't know about the white dude that bull, with the bull, both white dudes with the bulldogs. I wouldn't never know about them. Um, who is man made kennels? I wouldn't know about the hawk. I wouldn't know about 
all these people that you that you hate know at the end of the day this is my whole point of it you mad because he says he has the largest pit bull app well guess what you ain't all sold them in pit bulls and you ain't even sold what pit bull yet what pit bull you sold tell me when you sold one i'm waiting for it i'm waiting for it i'm waiting for it what 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 pit bull you sold now listen, you say me and Hope don't got pit bulls, but guess what the kid for about here? You haven't sold one. He sold so he sold a bunch of them. I sold five of them. Damn, damn. When did you did you listen? While you was talking about blue, you had killer before I had blue. And you let blue outdo killer and have him puppy. Killer ain't got zero puppy. Blue got six sons. Killer got no sons, no daughters. Let's talk about that. You want to get on your platform and talk? Let's talk about that. Let's talk about that. When we going to talk about that? Let's talk. Because you're not. Hold on. Let me get me a drink. But you know what you know what that tells me, and I was just sitting back thinking about it, look, looking at it. Every time you bred a female, since I've been on YouTube, it's been a bulldog. You are a bulldog person. Quit telling people you are a game dog person when you don't know nothing about them. You don't know nobody. All you know about bulldog. My, my granddaddy ran bulldog. My daddy ran bulldog. Nobody was running. Your daddy wasn't running no American people or terrorists. Your daddy wasn't messing with no American people with Terry. Your daddy wasn't no, your daddy was your daddy wasn't into that kind of lane. But you want you want to be in that lane because you want to be part of the popular group. You're not popular. You'll never be popular. You'll never be nothing but who you are. The YouTube clown. The YouTube hater. The, the you the same dude blackballed in the dog community. Straight blackballed in the dog community. Tell everybody about how you blackballed in the dog community. How nobody buy dogs from you. Nobody associate with you. All the dudes that you got on your channel that that's is is dudes that don't know nothing about dogs. So everything you say is law to them. Then they tell you stuff because you don't know how to read and you believe in law. So y'all basically just tell each other bullshit and y'all believe in the bullshit. But people, yeah, you know what you're talking about. You, yeah, 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 yeah. 1946, this blue dog been existed. So all you dumbass motherfuckers that say that stupid shit is funny to me. It's hilarious to me. You don't know nothing about no dogs. You you talking about your main concern is pit bulls, and you don't even know nothing about them. You don't know nothing. You don't even know how to condition them. You don't know how to walk. You don't know nothing. You know how to lock them in cages. Listen. And all dogs don't all dogs that you think like in the cage do not make you my dog like the cage. That's a sorry that's cute. That that that's what them them puppy meal people. You're not a puppy meal because you ain't selling no puppies. Well, real technically you are because you stuck on puppies, and a lot of puppy meals get stuck on puppy. You no, know, you use a want to be puppy meal, but you ain't got it going on. You don't got it going on. At the end of the day, this this one I'm still waiting on. When are you gonna show this dog? You always talk about oh boy. Oh, oh, uh, we 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 got English bulldog. What that's an English bulldog. That's an English bulldog. Show me your English bulldog. Please show me the English bulldog you got. Cause you don't have one to show. You don't have an English bulldog. Old rare English bulldog. You gotta have them dogs to call yourself that kennel. You need to change the name, bro. You ain't got nothing, but you ain't got it. You don't got it. We the old English bulldog. They hate on us. They hate on us. It's fake line. They hate on us. They mad because I say everything ain't a uh, uh, blue dog. They people. No, bro. That, listen, I let you say that for months. Quit saying my name. That's the whole point of you, dumb little motherfucker. Then you always talking about the, the, the disabled. When well, you know you rolled a little bit of yellow butt. Everything you speak about, I have people tease you and took your clothes and you was you 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 was the slow kid in in New York. That's why you don't go to New York, cause you the slow you was the slow dude in New York. 
You done had nothing going on. They used to take my clothes. I used to pull a knife on him. I used to let my bulldog, I used to let my dog bite them. Yeah, right. If your dog bit them, bro, you be, listen. We would have knew about that by now, bro. You, you, all you do is lie. We had, I had dog that I used to take hog hunting. If you would listen, let me put it like this. You know how many people, I do not do nothing. I, I do not train, breed for no legal purpose. People that get caught for dog fight still dog fight. So if you was a real, a uh, real hog hunt catching person, and you say, "Oh, right, we hog hunt," when, 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 uh, everything is my phone don't work unless I'm at home. We didn't see you shoot videos at tractor supply. We didn't see you shoot videos at at, at 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 your job at the social security office. We didn't see shoot videos everywhere, but your video don't. My, my my video don't work. Then I got goats and I got horses, and we never see you buy no no hay or no goat food. We see you buy chicken food, chicken. All you got is them little dogs and chicken. But you but we don't lie. We tell the truth. We tell the truth though. At the old oh, every, every every dog dog. Fuck on, bro. You don't tell no truth. You don't know. Listen. Then when I say something about you. He in Missouri. I'm in South Carolina. He don't know nothing about me. How y'all gonna do him? They don't know nothing about me, but then everything you say probably lie about us. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Tell me how you tell me how what you say at the law. Huh? And tell how that's what I want to know. How you what you say at the law? Hold on. That's the law right there. What I did. They don't know nothing about me. And you don't know nothing about me either. One thing you do know is you didn't get to breed your dog with my girl. Hey, listen. You can't stop a breeding on my yard. I stopped the breeding on your yard. <laughs> That's why you mad. Because you thought like all them, them other dummies that be on your channel. You thought you had a dummy. I'm going to need you to sign a contract. Yeah, hey, listen. Y'all just like the people that's in here. Listen. He say, look, so we on the phone. He like, yeah, the Hulk, the Hulk, the Hulk. I'm like, first of all, my man like, damn dude, hey, no dude, dog. Like, I don't give a fuck about no dude, dog. He like, hey, you know what? He like, let me see a picture of your girl. So I go and I make a video. He like, yeah, I can't breathe. I breathe my bloodline so strong. I can't breathe it no more. He's like, I'm going to need you to sign a contract, get it notarized. And send it back to me, and then I'm gonna sign it. And when the dog have puppies, I'm gonna need you to. I get the first two picks, and you gotta bring them to South Carolina. I'm like, bring what the no, bring? What am I gonna listen? What benefit I get out of breeding my dog with your dog? With when you already told me when I asked you what kind of paper the dog you had, you said your registry. When I looked up your registry, it wasn't nothing about your registry. So why was I gonna bring my dog with a dog who I know didn't have real papers that was under your registry? But yeah, but but you don't tell people about that. You tell everybody everything else, but you won't tell them about that. You told me to bring bring my girl to South Carolina, then turn around and bring some puppies to South Carolina after that. And I and I what was I getting out of? And you, and you can take your dog paper, but you won't tell people about this. Hey, you take your dog paper and register with my registry. I'm like, why would I take these papers? Because you, you see, they let the Hulk. He try to run a game. You, you see, they let the Hulk know there's a pit bull. Uh, that's how you know the registry. Fuck, that's how you know the registry. He used everybody's dog to say the registry messed up so he can try to get y'all money. You didn't have a dummy. That's your problem, dummy. You, didn't, you thought I was dumb enough to fall for that trap. Yeah, register your dog with my dog. Register your dog with my kennel club, and and we real. We we gonna we 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 gonna open up. We gonna we gonna have dog shows. I, I'm still it's three years later. I ain't seen the dog show yet. We we got people endorsing us and all that. And where the people that was endorsing y'all at? We got a we got a shelter. Where the shelter at? We take in dogs. We take in dogs with pedigree, and and. Who get listen? Who turns they pedigree dogs over with papers and pedigree to you guys for y'all to resell? Come on, bro, that didn't even sound right, you dummy. 
<coughs> you thought you had one, did you? You thought you really had one. <coughs> Just because you don't comprehend don't mean everybody else don't comprehend. Do you understand what I'm saying? <coughs> but you don't tell people that. You speak on me, but you don't speak on to tell the people the truth. That's how that, that that's how bad it was. Because I told you no, that your dog couldn't breathe my dog. You sat on the platform and told everybody she was fixed. But now you act like you ain't never say nothing about it. You don't never say nothing about that. You don't never speak about that. You hush up on that. Oh, he lied. Yeah, I never lied. Uh, dummy, do you remember on your platform telling everybody lady was fixed? The lady came from a shelter. The lady couldn't have a puppy. But you remember that. But you remember everything else besides that. You got short time memory on that. Real short time memory. Because you're a clown. You're a truly clown. That's what you exactly is, a clown. <coughs> I always talk about people being. <coughs> Listen, I'm going to tell you another thing that sounds stupid. And quit saying it. They don't think past zero. Zero is nothing, sir. If we talking about you, we th are thinking past zero. If we can breed dogs and sell them, we are thinking past zero. You can't think past zero because guess what? You're stuck with. 14 puppies out of 15. One died, sir. You lost one by death. And you ain't sold no puppy. You got a bulldog that's two years old that at the end of the day that you're going to listen, that you're going to either take dad back to, you're going to either take dad back to daughter or you're going to let brother sister breathe when you already know that these are per bred dogs. But you ain't. You so stupid. You'll do that. You so stupid. You don't have an out for your bulldog. So you just gonna the inbred them like you did that the, your month month that you was trying to breed with lady. Greasy bird bloodline. You got that so bad that you got listen, you so cheap. And I went to my we spare money. We buy for reputable breeding. Okay. Once you bred them bulldogs, you supposed to go get another girl or a boy. I never heard you say nothing about sire or damn, because you don't know what sire or damn mean. They mean mother, father. I'm gonna teach you something. Why you always trying to steal from me? Learn that. Say sigh and damn. Say it with me. Sigh and damn. Because you don't know nothing about it. You don't know nothing about it. You don't, you don't even know the phrases to talk about, dog. Only thing you sit on your platform and do is it, talk about other people's dogs. Other people's dogs. We don't hear nothing about your dog. How you sell a puppy? You, you don't even talk about them. All we hear, every time we hear, ah, ah, ah. Yeah, you 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 see that right there? See my dog. They they ain't nothing to play with. They ain't nothing to play with. They ain't nothing. You see that? You hear that? Listen. Do you hear that? That's not a selling tool. That's not a selling tool. Everybody, listen. You gotta remember these dogs are eight nine months old, right? If they were so much as you make them seem. I do not train breed for no legal purpose. If they were so much, what they what you make it is. Oh, great. You wouldn't be able to hit a cage to make them dogs stop doing what they're doing. You wouldn't be able to hit a cage to stop them dogs from doing what they're doing. You would have to actually have a breaking stick. If them dogs really what you make it seem like, I never see you use a breaking stick. I hear you going, hey, 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 hey. And they, no. If they really what they is, you heard, ah, 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 you would have to break it up. You don't have to break it up so that they're not what you make it seem like. Yeah, they have disagreement. But them dogs ain't what you make it seem like, clown. The dogs ain't what you make it seem like. You're doing too much. You're doing too much. When them dogs ain't what, they, what you make them seem. You worry about everybody in their mouth. <laughs> and you ain't sold no puppies. And hey, if you didn't hit the thumb up, I'm about to leave this building. Uh, I gave y'all almost two hours of uh talk. I know I ain't been here in a while. Appreciate y'all for showing up. Who all showed up and who all that watch you down the line? Appreciate you coming. But y'all have a nice show today. Happy Sunday to y'all.